I, Michael Bertram, take you, Natalia Prieto Marine, to be my wife. I promise to be faithful to you in good times and in bad, in sickness and in health, to love you and to honor you all the days of my life. Two worlds collide with our hearts. From today, you are a team. Separately, you are two wonderful people. But together, you are even better. You know how to make each other laugh and smile. And you know how to comfort each other. In the future, you will make important decisions together and will create meaningful moments and memories. However, along your life and love journey, there will be some days which are more challenging than others. On such days, remember to be kind to each other. Remember and focus on the attributes why you actually fell in love each other, with each other in first place. Be patient and understanding. Michael and Natalia, have you come here to enter into marriage without coercion, freely and wholeheartedly? I have. I have. I remember a few months before I met Natalia back in 2017 while I was traveling through Rome. Someone told me about the Trevi Fountain coin toss. In case you haven't heard about it yet, let me explain how it works. You toss one coin into the fountain and you return back to Rome. You toss two coins into the fountain and you'll find love. You toss three coins in the fountain and you'll find marriage. Can you guess how many coins I tossed? I literally met Natalia six months later at CYM and I instantly felt drawn to her. At that precise moment, I knew the coin toss worked. At the end of 2021, when I asked Natalia to marry me on top of Bluff Knoll, which is the tallest mountain in WA, I had no idea if we even make it up there. No jokes. What I meant to say is I had no idea how quickly our engagement would just fly past us. But here we are. A married couple, ready to conquer and succeed in our new chapter. To my husband, Michael. <laughs> I like the sound of that. <laughs> I want to thank you for making my life complete. I'm so lucky to be your wife and I look forward to our life together. Natalia and Michael, the last few weeks, the last few days, the last few hours, the last few moments have been very, very busy, stressful and exciting for you both. Everyone in this room understands it must be very, very hard for you to both, for both of you to enjoy actually this day and these moments. But please do so. I hope you can feel all the outpouring love for the both of you that is in this room for every single person in here. From the bottom of our heart, Carmen and I love you both forever and unconditionally and we are so proud of you both. Ladies and gentlemen, please raise your glass and here is a toast for a happy, healthy and successful marriage. Thank you.
Mike, you welcome us into your home. Thank you very much for that. Uh, in this short time, we have seen in you a uh, loving, intelligent, dedicated man, very adventurous as well to marry a Colombian woman, to learn some Spanish and even some dance moves, to explore your Latino side. <laughs> Dazu gehören auch die Wertschätzung des Partners, die Mitfreude, das gute Verständnis, die enge Verbundenheit, kameradschaftliche Gefühle und letztlich das Akzeptieren von Schwächen. Amor incluye apreciar a la otra persona, compartir los momentos felices sabiendo y complementándose el uno al otro un lazo fuerte y una amistad y no, no olvidar la aceptarse a sí mismo, al, al otro y sus debilidades. Natalia received this ring as a sign of my love and fidelity. Michael received this ring as a sign of my love and fidelity. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Natalia, you look absolutely stunning tonight. I can't keep my eyes off you. Could you please walk to the front? Pardon my French, but damn! In the presence of God and before this congregation, Michael and Natalia have given their consent and made their marriage vows to each other. They have declared their marriage by the joining of hands and by the giving and the receiving of rings. They are now husband and wife. <laughs>